What good YouTube, it's Master Mewtwo here, and I'm coming to you with episode number one of the Pokemon Glazed Nuzlocke. So, I've combed through all the comments, looked at all the names, and there's all the starters there. I think I have to talk to the professor again. I ended up saving it at the door, as you saw, and on the last episode, you can't not canceled making a selection so what I did was save the door and now I have to go through all this again so time to pick the starter and resoundingly no one chose Turtwig one person chose Chimchar we got Sin choosing Shinx and Mr. Dex and then we had a couple Riolus but the winner Piplup. Obtained Piplup, it seemed, seems excited. Yes, and the name provided by Glol HD Oceanus. Ah, you picked a Piplup. I always had a special fondness for Piplup. I'd usually give you a Pokedex, but I just gave my last one out a few days ago and haven't received any more. I have a friend called the Inventor who lives in Chaco Town. I believe he has a spare Pokedex or two. Would you mind seeing him? If your Pokemon are feeling weak, feel free to talk to the aide near the healing machine. Safe travels! Okay, so we got our starter. Let's check him out. Oceanus. That was a seal sound, I believe, but okay. Pound growl, nature, nature, where's the hardy nature? Hardy nature is crap, isn't it? Ah, garbage. Oh, can't I can't run yet? I thought I could run. Oh, well. Gotta head to Chaco Town, and I'm going the wrong way already, I know it. Chaco Town, not that way either. This way. Old man and boy. It seems like there's quite a ruckus down this route. My eyes weren't what they once was. My eyes weren't what they once was. Ugh. Unfortunately, so I can't really tell for sure, but I thought I should give you a heads up. Go on, Chew. Let us pass. Pikachu. Hey, Pikachu. Quit harassing my parents and look them through. The Pikachu attacks. This is the freaking Pikachu that's going to be plaguing me. This is like my rival in a way. And I look like a Super Saiyan and I'm going to get eaten alive. Thank God this Pikachu is only level 2. Oh, this sucks. Well, I don't understand why Pikachu has to sound like a freaking Porygon, though. There we go. PP Pikachu. Off he goes. James, that was fantastic. You're an amazing battler. I had a feeling Professor Willow would be giving you a Pokemon. So, my, me and your father got you some presents for your journey. Ooh. Here you go, this is my gift. Running shoes. That is the, was the best pair of running shoes I could find. I hope you like them. If you want to run, just hold down B. Yep. I'm not that good at getting gifts, but I thought you could use one of these. It's very useful. Experience share. Very nice. I also got new batteries for your clock. Do you have the time? What time is it? About 10, af 10 to 7. So... Let's move it all the way down. There's six. That'll do. Yes. All right, thanks, James. We'd better head on home now before that crazy Pikachu comes back. Listen, now that you have your own Pokemon, why don't why not challenge the gym leaders of Tunod? Just a thought, but having a goal while traveling makes the journey that much more exciting. Not journey, Mom. If I remember correctly, there's a gym in Ocean View City. Safe travels. 
Alright, so we need a grass type Pokemon, clearly. Run through the grass. Although I can't catch anything yet, so. Tilo. Because Oceanus needs to level up at least once and then head back to heal. Stupid Taylor. Growl me to freaking. There we go. Hey, level 6. Special defense is going up quickly already. Alright, let's go back to Professor Willow. Would you like the yes? Let's is missing an apostrophe. It was a complete success. Everyone seems happy and healthy. I wish you safe travels. Alright. Time to... I'm not even the running animation isn't right. Fell inside. Let's see. Centric. Won't be fighting that much in this episode. Just gonna... Coming through! Hey, you there. I heard that there was a Pikachu around here. Have you seen it? Yeah, I just scared it off. Where's the space where the colon is? What? Grumble. Okay, there should be asterisks. Asterisks there. In that case, who are you? My name's James. Well, my name's Percy. There's a missing apostrophe. And this is my partner, Cyndaquil. Since we missed that Pikachu, how about we battle instead? What do you say, Cyndaquil? So Cyndaquil corners me. We're both fired up. Let's battle. All right. Should have leveled up to learn bubble. Pokemon trainer Percy would like to battle. Sends out Cyndaquil dancing around. Oh, why am I good moving the mouser over there for? You couldn't see it, but... Okay, so it's, it's a speed tie between me and Cyndaquil. I just won the speed tie twice and got the crit. Down goes Cyndaquil. 69 experience. Level 7. Beautiful. Holy smokes. Yowzers, you're tough. You'll definitely be a worthy rival for me. God. Since that Pikachu's gone, I'll head to Ocean View City. See you. Jeez, at least do it properly. This is in the frickin' chat room. Sia should be S-E-E -E space. Yeah. Damn it. I would, like, if there was such thing as a rage lock, I would lose at it because I'd rage every time I'd see a mistake. So if I was playing something like Flora Sky, I would get destroyed, like, right away. As soon as I got the Pokedex, it's gonna be like, oh god, keep it all in. Okay, there goes Sentret. I forgot I was not going to fight it. Oh well. Let's just get through the forest pass. Welcome to Chaco Town. Perfect. Let's get into the Pokemon Center. Heal up. I don't know if you can hear that in the background. I don't even know who that is or what that is. Chaco Town is a great place for the elderly to relax and enjoy life. It's so calm here. Pokemon Center, yes. Okay. Many trainers wonder where the Pokemon is at town. It's too small for once. We just have the local general store in the middle of town. That's not here. Stop running around, kid. Uncle Jake, judge of Pokemon's happiness. Give me frustration. Seems neither happy nor sad. Okay, fine. Don't give me anything. Probably gives me return if Pokemon's super happy. Statue of Mew. This is the general store with candy and more. Okay, let's see. What... Okay, so already with a bunch of stuff. Let's see. Gotta get six of them already. No. Okay, might as well get a, two paralysis heals. And cancel that. Nope. 
Okay, you're gonna give me balls. Not that I... Nope, you're gonna give me steroids. Okay, so we got all I can here. No Pokeballs. I was promised 500 poke yen if I watch Grandpa today, but all these soap operas are making me bored. Since I'm retired, I have nothing better than watch soap operas all day. Oh, to be young. Really? Okay, come on. Gotta find the event inventor. Have you been in the milkshake swamp? It's so gross and icky. Oh, I already talked. I already... Damn it. I love staring out over the pond. It's very calming. We got a camper here. Went for the inventor. His inventions make our town proud. So this must be the inventor's place. Is there anything around here? Nope, just a beach. Look, I made a sandcastle. I tried to make it look like a tower on that island out on the horizon. Don't you dare step on it. Aw, oh, I can't step on it. Let's see which rock is going to give me an item. None of them. Okay, fine. We have, to, we have to constantly be thinking of new ideas, or our inventions will become obsolete. It's great to be an engineer. We are allowed to make anything we want to. That's not true. I'm te- I'm- mm, Phosphory. I'm testing the breaking strength of various materials with this machine. Did you know that the inventor was the creator of the clapper? Okay. I'm running vibrations tests. God. Why is that S there? To make sure it doesn't fall apart when shaken. I've, if I've told you once, I've told you a thousand times, don't disturb me while I'm working. Oh, I'm so sorry. I thought you were one of my pestering aides. You'll be James, correct? Professor Willow sent me an email a short while ago, and I have your Pokedex. Here you go. Okay, take these as well. That's a sort of gift to help you fill out the Pokedex's entries. And we got Pokeballs, which means I can start catching stuff. James, you mind if I ask for a huge favor? There are some wonderful ruins in the milkshake swamp that I'd like to observe, but I'd feel much safer with an escort. Would you mind coming with me? The entrance to the swamp is in the north of town. I'll be seeing you soon, I hope. Let's see, that's, a tw that's all that for 12 minutes. And again, I talk to a lot of people. So let's go to the milkshake swamp. At least get, actually, let's get our encounter over here. That way I have something to train while I'm waiting. Oh, hello, Ratata. I like you. All right, pound. One more pound will do it. And Ratata's in catching range. Time to throw that Pokeball. Ten of them. Perfect. Okay. Thank you. Ratatas caught. Ratatas in the decks. A Ratatas cautious in the extreme. To the extreme. Even when well, it's asleep, it constantly moves its ears and listen, listens for danger. It will make its nest anywhere. And it's a foot tall. That's amazing. Okay, Ratatas... And it's a boy. Mm. Um, I'm thinking nah, buddy. If anyone gets that joke, nah, buddy. Nah, buddy. Okay, let's check out nah, buddy's stats. Let's first, switch him to the front. Nah, buddy. With guts. Quiet nature. Crap. Well, attack and speed are great, though. Nine and nine. So let's go heal up. I'm going to be looking up the natures to make sure that that gnaw buddy can stand up to a lot of punishment. Alright. Thank you. Let's see, should I call it an episode? Okay, so this was Forest Pass, so that's done. What's. Oh, it's just a bridge to a sign. 
Okay, so let's head back around, up and around. Actually, hold on. I have an experience share. Why aren't I using that? Give experience share to Nob Buddy. And then switch Nob Buddy and Oceanus. And let's go at least get into Milkshake Swamp. Make my catch there. Uh, James, you won't believe this, but these guys won't let me get into the Milkshake Swamp. Nobody enters the swamp. Go do something else instead. Still preying on innocent travelers, Team Fusion. I never thought you'd stoop so low. I've already run off the rest of your gang in the swamp already, so you have no reason to stay here. Of course, if you have any need to protest, my dark rye is itching for a battle. Our objectives here are complete. We'll be taking our leave now. Did those grunts harm you? No, thank goodness. I'm sorry. Allow me to introduce myself. My name is Blake, and I'm a member of the Two Not Elite Four. I've taken it upon myself to protect travelers such as you. Blah, blah. Just out of curiosity, why are you both going into the Milkshake Swamp? It's not exactly the most fun place to be. I was curious about some ruins in the swamp. James is going to escort me to them. In case any wild Pokemon attack, I don't have any Pokemon, you see. Team Fusion, those men preventing you from entering the swamp, are poking around those same ruins. Allow me to escort you there myself, to make sure I frightened them all off. I'm sure James wouldn't want to be hanging around with two adults anyway. You've just begun as a trainer. Continue to keep striving for your dreams. And rest assured, they'll come true. One day, we may even battle. Come, inventor. Scientific exploration awaits. No, I wanted... Whoa, okay. Yeah, aren't glitches fun? Okay, so... Funny thing about the swamp. Where, see, a patch like that... Instant poison to your whole team. And it's there, too. Those, they're brambles of some sort. So let's... It's, I think it's to your top member of the team. So if we catch a poison type like this... Beautiful Ekans. I love Ekans. I love Arbok more, but Ekans is... Ekans is up there. So our encounter for the Milkshake Swamp is Ekans with Intimidate. Bam. I wanted it to have Shedskin. I love Shedskin. I want to switch in and switch out. But if I get wrapped, then I'm screwed. Okay, nah, buddy. Come on. Atkins uses wrap, okay. And I only took two damage. I like that. Okay, how much do I take after that? One. Tackle. Okay, I'm going to definitely throw a ball now. Rain continues to fall. Let's speed through that. Wrap. Pokeball, go. Aw, oh, what? Come on, Ekans. Oh, come on, Ekans. Okay. I can't switch out yet. Don't kill it. Thank you. And freed from wrap. Switching right now. Perfect. Okay, Pokeball go. Let's get the seconds. One, two, three. Yes. Perfect, perfect, perfect. And Ekans curls itself up in a spiral while it rests. This position allows it to quickly respond to an enemy from any direction with a threat from its upraised head. Yes, we're going to nickname this Ekans. We're going to nickname you Commando with a K. Why Commando with a K? Because Cobra Commander. And he's a Cobra Commando. Because Arbok is Cobra backwards with a K instead of a C. Anyway. And the so I'm probably going to grind up, get them all up to level 15. No, the 15 is too much, too early. Um, level 10, at least. Um, yeah, level 10 will do. Um, and I'd like to thank you all so much for watching. This was episode 1. We have Anekins, we have Rattata, we have Oceanus the Piplup. And I just burped a little bit. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. This is... No. Yeah. Wait. I've... 
completely forgotten my outro because I haven't done it in forever. This is Master Mewtwo. This was Pokemon Glaze Nuzlocke Episode 1. If you like what you're seeing so far, have you slammed that like button. And if you want to keep tuned in to what's coming after and get ahead of this series, Psy Strike that subscribe button.